Welcome to my channel. I'm thrilled to have you here as we embark on another journey to explore some of the world's most remarkable destinations. Whether you're a long-time traveler or someone who simply loves discovering new places from the comfort of your screen, this channel is all about bringing you closer to the wonders that make our world so incredibly fascinating. From the bustling streets of major cities to the quiet corners of hidden gems, each location has its own story, and today, we're diving into one that is truly special. Italy, a country that needs no introduction, is a land where history, art, and culture intertwine to create an experience unlike any other. From the rolling hills of Tuscany to the ancient ruins of Rome, Italy captivates the heart with its timeless beauty and rich heritage. Whether it's the cuisine, the language, or the art, every corner of this country offers something to discover and fall in love with. Each region, each city, has its own unique character, contributing to the rich tapestry that is Italy. Today, we're heading to one of Italy's most dynamic and vibrant cities, Milan. Known as the fashion capital of the world, Milan is much more than just a hub for style and design. It's a city where history meets modernity, where ancient architecture stands proudly alongside contemporary creations. And at the heart of this incredible city lies a masterpiece of Gothic architecture, the Duomo di Milano. Located in the very heart of Milan, the Duomo Cathedral stands as the centerpiece of the city, dominating Piazza del Duomo with its awe-inspiring presence. This iconic landmark is situated in the bustling city center, making it easily accessible and impossible to miss. Surrounded by vibrant streets filled with shops, cafes, and historical buildings, the Duomo is not just a place of worship but also a central point of life in Milan. The piazza itself is always alive with energy, with locals and tourists alike gathering to admire the cathedral's stunning facade or simply enjoy the lively atmosphere. Adjacent to the cathedral, you'll find the Galleria Vittorio Emanuele II, one of the world's oldest shopping malls, offering a blend of luxury boutiques and charming cafes under its magnificent glass dome. This area, with its rich blend of history, culture, and modernity, perfectly encapsulates the spirit of Milan, making the Duomo not just a must-see, but a true symbol of the city. As we approach the grand entrance of the Duomo Cathedral, the excitement of stepping into this architectural marvel is palpable. We pull out our printed tickets, which we purchased online in advance, ready to present them at the entrance. The process is smooth as we hand over our tickets to the staff, who efficiently check them and direct us through the entrance. The doors open, revealing the interior's breathtaking beauty. As we step inside, the cool, shadowed expanse of the cathedral envelopes us, and the intricate details of the Gothic architecture begin to reveal themselves promising a memorable exploration of this historic and sacred space. As we ascend to the top floors of the Duomo Cathedral, the sense of anticipation builds. We step onto the terraces, and the bustling city of Milan stretches out below us, but it's the rich architectural details that immediately capture our gaze. Each step on the polished marble floors of the terraces feels like a step deeper into a masterpiece of Gothic design. From this vantage point, we are treated to a breathtaking view of the cathedral spires, which rise dramatically against the sky. These spires, each meticulously sculpted and adorned with elaborate carvings, create a forest of stone pinnacles that seem to reach for the heavens. The Gothic architecture is defined by these vertical elements, which draw the eye upwards and showcase the cathedral's ambition and grandeur. The spires, crafted with incredible precision, feature intricate patterns and delicate stonework that reflect the light, adding a mystical quality to the scene. Looking around, we notice the stunning tracery of the Gothic windows, which are now within close reach. The detailed filigree that frames the stained glass is a marvel of craftsmanship. The windows, with their delicate patterns, are more than just decorative, they also serve as a testament to the skill and artistry of the craftsmen who created them. Each piece of stained glass is like a story told in color, casting vibrant hues and shadows onto the cathedral's interior and illuminating the space with an ethereal glow. As we walk along the terraces, our attention is drawn to the countless statues that adorn the upper reaches of the cathedral. These statues, representing saints, angels, and various religious figures, are carved with remarkable detail. From their serene expressions to their flowing robes, every feature is meticulously rendered, giving them an almost lifelike presence. 
Many of these statues have undergone extensive restoration work over the years. The stone, subjected to centuries of weathering and pollution, has been carefully cleaned and repaired. Skilled artisans use traditional techniques to restore these figures, ensuring that they retain their original splendor while being protected from further damage. The cathedral's buttresses, visible from our elevated position, are another marvel of Gothic engineering. These massive structures, designed to support the weight of the cathedral's vaulted ceilings, are adorned with intricate carvings and detailed stonework. They not only provide structural support but also contribute to the cathedral's majestic appearance. The buttresses are complemented by decorative gargoyles, which serve both a functional and aesthetic purpose. These gargoyles, with their grotesque and whimsical designs, channel rainwater away from the cathedral's walls, preventing erosion and damage. Each gargoyle is unique, reflecting the creative imagination of the artisans who sculpted them. The process of maintaining and restoring these elements is a continuous and meticulous endeavor. The cathedral stonework, exposed to the elements for centuries, requires regular conservation to safeguard its integrity. As we continue our exploration of the terraces, the panoramic views of Milan's skyline provide a stunning contrast to the detailed craftsmanship around us. The juxtaposition of the ancient cathedral with the modern cityscape below highlights the enduring significance of the Duomo as both a historical and cultural landmark. Every detail, from the ornate spires and intricate statues to the functional gargoyles and supportive buttresses, tells a story of artistry, dedication, and historical continuity. Standing on the roof of the Duomo di Milano, you are greeted by a breathtaking panorama that blends architectural splendor with urban vibrancy. The city stretches out before you, a mix of historic red-tiled roofs and modern skyscrapers, all interconnected by Milan's bustling streets. In the distance, the snow-capped Alps rise majestically, a striking contrast to the warm tones of the city. Your eyes are drawn to the countless statues adorning the Duomo's roof. These stone figures, angels, saints, and biblical characters, stand like silent sentinels against the sky. Each one is uniquely carved, some in deep contemplation, others with dramatic, outstretched arms as if reaching towards the heavens. The intricate spires and pinnacles rise around you, their delicate stonework a testament to centuries of craftsmanship. The golden statue of the Virgin Mary, the Madonnina, crowns the highest spire, her serene gaze casting a perpetual blessing over the city. Below, the marble floor's elaborate geometric patterns mirror the grandeur of the cathedral. Light and shadow play across the stone, enhancing the sense of height and space. Above, the vast blue sky stretches out, dotted with drifting clouds, a reminder of the passage of time against the enduring beauty of this magnificent structure. Every direction offers something to marvel at, the city below, the statues and spires, or the endless sky above. On the roof of the Duomo, you stand at the intersection of history, art, and the living world. As we leave behind the breathtaking views from the terraces and roof of the Duomo di Milano, we begin our descent into the heart of this magnificent cathedral. The stairs, worn smooth by centuries of pilgrims and visitors, spiral downwards, guiding us into the depths of history itself. Each step echoes the footsteps of countless souls who have marveled at this architectural wonder. Finally, we reach the lowest floor, where the grandeur of the Duomo's interior begins to unfold before our eyes. As we step into the main nave, we are immediately struck by the sheer scale of the space. The cathedral is one of the largest in the world, and its towering columns stretch up towards the heavens, making us feel as though we are standing in the presence of something truly divine. The light filters through the enormous stained glass windows, casting vibrant hues of red, blue, and gold onto the marble floor. These windows are not just decorative, they tell the stories of the Bible and the lives of saints, inviting us to contemplate the rich history and spirituality embedded in every corner of the cathedral. As we walk along the central nave, our eyes are drawn to the intricate details that adorn the interior. The columns, adorned with ornate carvings of saints, apostles, 
and intricate foliage, rise majestically towards the vaulted ceiling. Each column is unique, a testament to the craftsmanship of the countless artists who dedicated their lives to the construction of this masterpiece. Our path takes us towards the altar, a focal point of the cathedral. We pause here, taking in the awe-inspiring beauty of the altar, before turning our attention to the side chapels. These chapels, each one a small masterpiece in its own right, line the aisles of the cathedral. Dedicated to various saints and important figures in the history of the church, they are adorned with exquisite paintings, sculptures, and relics. The air is heavy with the scent of incense, a reminder of the many prayers that have been offered in this sacred space. Continuing our journey, we make our way to the Duomo's most famous sculpture, the statue of Saint Bartholomew Flayed. This haunting piece, sculpted by Marco Diagrate, depicts the saint holding his own skin, a powerful symbol of martyrdom and faith. The realism and detail of the sculpture are striking, a stark reminder of the sacrifices made in the name of belief. Finally, we conclude our journey by admiring the vastness of the space one last time, standing in awe beneath the towering ceiling, feeling the weight of history and the beauty of faith that this cathedral embodies. The Duomo di Milano is more than just a building, it is a living testament to the dedication, artistry, and devotion of generations of believers. As we exit the cathedral, we carry with us not just memories of its grandeur, but a sense of the sacred that lingers long after we've left its hallowed halls. Milan is a city where history and modernity blend seamlessly, and the Duomo is a symbol of its enduring legacy. Thank you for joining me on this journey through one of the world's most iconic cathedrals. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more explorations of fascinating places. Your support means the world to me.